Hello everyone, Alexander here with some sad aviation news for you today. Today is the 2nd of October 2018 and we just found out that Primera Air went bankrupt and I will explain why in this video. For those of you who don't know who Primera Air was, it was a Danish airline established in 2009 who operated a scheduled and charter business carrier model successfully until now. Today Primera Air has officially ceased operations. According to their press release, the reason for that is poor financial standing, delivery delays of the Airbus A321neo and being unable to secure long-term financing. This was the press release that they did. With a great regret, we must inform you that Primera Air will cease all operations on the midnight of October 1st, 2018 and enter administration process. And down there it says, in 2017, the company lost one aircraft from operations due to severe corrosion problems and had to bear the total cost of rebuilding resulted in a loss of more than 10 million euros. 2018 began with a fantastic start of our low cost long haul project with a brand new Airbus 321 Neo fleet. However, due to severe delays of aircraft deliveries, this beginning ended up being rocky and incredibly problematic. Definitely a lot of problems uh, for them in uh, the financial uh, part, but as well, if you think about the competition, you know, you have Ryanair, you have Norwegian, you have EasyJet, a lot of airlines fighting for this, the same uh, uh, destinations and flights and the same passenger target as Primera Air. So there's competition as well. The independent BBC, they all uh, reported that passengers are being stranded in airports. It causes a lot of disruption and chaos. I have a friend of mine, Marina, she's Romanian. She's a cabin crew for Primera Air. She's been there one month. And let me tell you something, they were still recruiting cabin crew until they ceased operations. Therefore, even in the management, they had no idea about what's going to happen. They didn't know that they're going to cease operations. They didn't know they were going bankrupt. They were still hiring, <laughs> which is, you know, funny and sad in the same time. This is a photo of me and Marina, by the way. Marina, my friend, she's still in London right now. She doesn't know what to do. She basically, she has to go home. There's no more an airline to fly for. Um, unfortunately, and they uh, had the email sent to all of the cabin crew. Um, it's already in the press, so what I present you here is nothing that hasn't been released. According to boardingpass.ro, this is the email that she and her colleagues received. Dear colleagues, it is with great regret I am reaching out to all of you this dark day. We have just been informed that both Primera Air Nordic and Primera Air Scandinavia will file for bankruptcy tomorrow, October 2nd, 2018 and uh, so on and so forth. The email tells them about it. Look at this one. God knows it has not been without its challenges. So there's a bit of drama over there. Of course, the person who sent this email was affected as well by the situation. Um, we can all, all understand that. If anyone seeing this video was an affected passenger, I hope you can get on other flights and I hope you can get your payment back and all of that. Um, this stuff can happen in the aviation industry. It is nothing new. This happened in the past, like Monarch uh, Airlines that went for bankruptcy and Air Berlin as well recently. So this can happen throughout the years. All the info I provided in this video is publicly available information and news. You will find it all over the web. Now, thank you all for watching my video. Please subscribe to get more videos like this, updates, travel vlogs, aviation news, and so on and so forth. Thank you all again. Thumbs up and peace.